Hi, my name is Aaron from Superior Singing Method, and in this video I want to talk about how to sing. Okay, how to sing. Uh, kind of a broad topic, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to narrow it down. At the end of this, I'm going to give you a, a really good exercise, one of my favorite exercises, that will get you a little farther down the road of actually how to sing. But let's talk for a minute uh, about how to sing. What does that even mean to learn how to sing and sing better? Um, I break it down into, you know, sometimes three, sometimes four different categories, but um, I'll give you four right now. Um, ha learning how to sing is learning the instruction part. So right now, this is part of the instruction. I'm going to give you, uh, I'm going to give you that vocal exercise, but just give you a little bit of instruction about the voice and how it works and how singing works, because the more you know about the voice and how the voice works when it comes to singing, the more you can apply these techniques and concepts to singing and to the exercise themselves to start shaping your voice the way you want it to be so you have the best tone the most resonant resonant full kind of sound you can hit the high notes all that kind of stuff so um, instructions the first part second part is I guess kind of obvious are the exercises um, got to have the exercises because the exercises just like um, the rest of your body you need to work out you know exercise to to keep it in shape and to be able to make your body do the things that you want it to be able to do to have the flexibility and the strength to do what you want to do um, third one is systematic learning learning singing systematically is really the way to go um, get I actually the link below is I have an eight week systematic program that you can check out um, at some point but I believe that the system systematic is the way to go because you learn the right things at the right time and you're um, you not only systematically doing um, the exercises but you're also doing uh, learning the things in the right order and doing the things in the right amount of time and repeating there's a lot of repetition which leads me to the next one and that's just being consistent um, re use the repetition to consistently build and build and build your voice so those are kind of the four main things and just along the lines of that last one the repetition is I know that's kind of the difficult part I, I think we live in a culture that that we don't want to do things over and over and we don't want to like work really hard to get to things and I get that and and with these videos my my point and my goal is get you singing as good as you could possibly sing as fast as possible for sure but it does take repetition and it takes time and um, as you do as you do the exercises this one that I'm about to give you and, and other exercises of course you need a variety of exercises but this is a really good one um, you know it's not just going to take once and you're going to sing better you know that intuitively you know you're not just going to get better by oh do this exercise for 10 minutes and I can sing better um, but if you do this consistently for two or three days you know a week two weeks you know th those kind of things you will start it's not like all of a sudden you'll be like the greatest thing in the world but you will notice a marked improvement in your voice you'll see improvement and that will encourage you to be more consistent and get more instruction do more exercises do the systematic thing and, and you know the consistency and repetition so the what I want to talk to you about um, today the uh, the instructional part and this is all instruction but the instructional part of the actual voice and how it works what I want to talk about is the larynx the larynx this is one of the uh, one of the problems that most singers have is that when they go to sing high notes uh, uh, what they're doing is they're, they're raising their larynx up maybe you, have, you do this as well um, when I'm not paying attention and I'm singing sometimes I, I still even do it you got to be conscious of um, when you're doing it but um, the hey, that whole larynx raising thing whereas you want to keep your larynx this is your larynx here you want to keep your larynx steady when you sing and this exercise that I'm about to give you is one of the exercises that will help you keep your larynx steady now you don't want your larynx to raise up but you don't necessarily want it really low because when your larynx is really low it's like hey hi there hi there you know you don't want to sing like that either so you want to kind of steady to a little bit low and that's what this exercise will help you to do this exercise is the mum mum exercise um, this is a just a really good kind of classic exercise that will help you to keep your larynx low keep it steady it will also help you with chord compression this is also a really big one too is keeping your cord your vocal cords um, gripped together and, and having the compression that you need to be able to sing through your different transitions because through your transitions the breaks in your voice a lot of times your cords will split apart and that's where cracks and breaks come so it'll help with that too so good vocal cord closure and also the mum the M consonant will give you a good launching off point the mum 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 give you a good launching off point to keep that that's what gets that kind of chord um, chord closure chord compression so um, this is what we're gonna do with the mums we're gonna do mum 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 so do that with me right now 
mom, 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 and just that uh, uh, uh sound helps keep your larynx low. So it starts training your voice to as it climbs up the higher, higher in the notes to to stay nice and steady. Mom, 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 and then raise it up. Mom, 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 and just keep keep raising it up as high as you want to go. Don't go too high. You don't want to strain your voice, but. Um, this is a really good exercise um, for all those all those benefits. Keep good chord closure. Keep your larynx low. Um, you, you got that M that is that good good bouncing off point to keep keep the compression started and then keep it you know, the vocal cord compression as you go through your transition. So it's a really it's a really great exercise. Um, practice this couple 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 minutes a day. Um, go you know all all throughout your range and it'll help you. And that that uh 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 sound the mum mum again will help you keep your vocal cords together as you hit those different transitions and as you go all throughout your range. So I want to encourage you to uh, to do the work. To do, if you really want to be a singer, do do the work to become a singer. It, it does take work, and um, I'll bet you it takes less work than you think it does. But it does take work, and so just begin the process. And there's so many rewards along the way that, as you know, you know, like I said, you, after a few days and weeks, you notice, hey, I'm getting better at this, and it's encouraging. So it creates this momentum, and before you know it, you're reaching your dreams, and you're like, oh man, that was totally worth it. So um, pursue your dreams. And uh, also, if you haven't had a chance to subscribe to the channel, um, uh, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I, I do lots of new videos all the time. And like I said, that link below, there's not only my, my systematic program, but also a lot of free videos, a lot, just a lot of free tips and stuff there too. But like I said, you can also get my eight-week systematic, fully, you know, all the exercises and techniques that you need for your voice. You can find that there too. And if you like the video, Go ahead and like the video, and then uh, leave me a comment too. A lot of the uh, th videos that I do are because people left a comment about wanting to learn a little, you know, what some particular thing. So I hope this was helpful. I honestly, genuinely wish you the best with your singing, and I want I want what you want. I want you to to accomplish your dreams as a singer. So um, so go after them.